Palestine is the land that is still fighting to get its freedom. The word freedom cost all the Palestinians a lot. It cost them their land, their home, their families, their children, their mothers and fathers. It cost them to lose almost everything in life, but they are still alive. This and what, all, what everything that happened in Gaza, it doesn't prevent them to continue dreaming. And I'm here actually to make my, my seemingly unachievable, unachievable dreams achievable. Freedom costs us a lot. And this happened also to the activists, activists who came to Gaza to end the siege, to help Palestinians to get their freedom and their families. Rachel, she was one of them. She was one of the international activists who was killed in Rafa, in the south of Gaza, simply because she fought for the freedom of humanity. Not just for Palestinians, it's for humanity as well. She witnessed the injustice in her own eyes, with her own eyes. All human beings have this sense of peace inside themselves, but they need something to push them to discover this, to move to this, to this position. So they try to help Palestinians who are in an ongoing, an ongoing conflict with the Zionist entity. Rachel, Vittorio, and others, they all were there just to help Palestinians to get their freedom. We have to go back to our origin, to our nature. We have to go back to our original nature, let the peace inside us control and lead us to move. I wish all human beings to be one hand, all together against words and dehumanity activist actions. I wish that Palestinians can get what they want, at least for a second in their lives. I wish they can live in peace, they can be secured, and they can breathe the fresh air the fresh air without any fear at all. They can move easily. They can do whatever they want without any fear. Please, my message maybe and my request from you just to help us to get this freedom. Fight against wars and massacres. We are all human and we should keep this humanity for all and dismiss the dehumanity actions that Palestinians are really living. Thank you.